Hi, I'm Paula with Barbarian Borbles, and I am going to be having draft day today for the Barbarian Buka and Barbarian Ruger litter. They are seven weeks old. We had 13 puppies, uh, seven boys and six girls, and um, six of those puppies were black. It's five black males and one black female. So they are getting ready to go to their new home, so I just wanted to show everybody, and we can talk about draft day. I did keep two black males out of this breeding for our program. So two of them are gonna be staying with us. And this guy right here is one of them. So uh, he's gonna be staying with us, um, but I will go get the rest of them and um, start showing you. This is our other keeper. He's the one I was telling you about, is much taller, as you can see. He's probably gonna be a tall boy like Ruger is. Um, and of course, naturally with tall, he doesn't look quite as thick right now, but we all know that that all comes in time. So sometimes puppies grow and they just get taller and taller and the thick just doesn't come till later. So we kept him because we think that's probably exactly what's gonna happen. And if he turns out to look like his dad, um, that's gonna be a really good thing for us. This is Blue Collar Boy. He's got a, a nice big head, um, nice chest, a little bit of white on his chest. I think he's got, also has a great top line um, and angulation seems to be spot on. He's got a really nice chest bump here, barrel chest, um, beautiful head, super confident little puppy. And boy, you're being such a good boy. Why can't they all be like this? <laughs> and this is Beige Collar Boy. To me, him and Blue look pretty much almost identical. Except for he's got just a little bit more white on his chest. Nice head, nice chest. Let's see, let's see if you do as good as your brother. Great top line tail set. No, you're not gonna sit still as long, are you? <laughs> But um, like I said, this is a real spunky litter. They are super outgoing. They run to you at the second you come in there. Um, they're yapping, they wanna be held. They're jumping on the shovel when I'm scooping poop. So little balls of energy in this litter. They got their collars off. So he is one of the taller ones in the litter along with the the one boy that we kept, he's got a beautiful chest. He's already showing that muscle definition. Great head. You're pretty mellow, dude. Yeah. Hmm. Let's see what you look like on the side. All right. From the side, looks really good. He's got a great tail. We like doing our tails just a little bit longer because when they're just looking confident and they have a little longer tail, that kind of curves in. To me, there's just nothing more beautiful than that. I mean, it's just, it just exuberates confidence and um, pride and that they're just a strong dog. So not a fan of short tails, but again, he's got just a beautiful chest and a really sweet boy. This is the black collar boy. He's very similar to the red collar. Uh, again, really sweet. He seems like he's just a little bit more mellow. Um, great head, nice chest, showing muscle definition, got some nice length to his legs, great top line, nice angulation, nice chest bone from the side. I like to see this and I love to see a nice crest in the neck. Oh, I'm getting wore up. So this is Black Collar Boy and he is a sweetie. This is Pink Girl. She's already been selected. She was the pick of the litter, but I'm just gonna include her anyway so her new owner can see her. A beautiful feminine female. She's got a nice chest, got some white on her chest. She's super sweet. Let's see how you stand, honey. She's one of the taller ones, so she's her and um, the one male that's taller that I'm keeping, they were the tallest in the litter. So she's gonna have some height to her too, I believe. But she's got, she looks like she's got good angulation. Again, nice top line. 
uh, very happy and frisky. So she's going to be going to Miami pretty soon and join, joining her new family. This is pink color girl. This is yellow girl. She is nice and thick and got a great head. She's got really nice chest and pecs showing already. Great shoulders. My favorite thing about this girl is her tail set, but she's not going to do it right now. But when she walks around, that thing is curled backwards. So she's, uh, I would say, ultra confident. She looks like she's got good angulation. Again, a great top line. Beautiful head. So this, she's a beautiful girl. I really like her. This is Yellow Girl. So when it came to females, this litter did not disappoint. Not at all. This is teal collared female. She is stunning. A nice head, beautiful dark mask. She's got some white on her chest. Already look at them shoulders. She's got some pecs going on. And she is just a beauty. Let's see. Stand up. Nice tail set, nice angulation. You guys are standing up so good. This is, I was telling you that they're confident. Super confident litter, very beautiful, very sweet, and fearless. This is Orange Girl. She's just a little bit redder. I think the reddest one in the litter is teal, and then next would be her. She has more red in their coat, which will likely get darker as they get older. Uh, she's a real sweetheart, too. Again, just like, Super consistent litter, great top line, great, great chest, just a little white patch on her. And then, here you go, great top line. She's got a nice chest bump. Again, with the, the nice gradual slope in between her eyes, she's just, she's a beautiful girl. Here is the last one. This is Purple Girl. She's got a beautiful shaped head. She's got a nice mask. She's got the little black eyebrows. A little bit of white on her chest. A little taller. Great structure, great bone. Let's see how she does from the side. She's a happy little thing. Stand up. She's got a great tail set. Angulation looks good. Very happy, very confident puppy. Yeah, you're just a sweetie, aren't you? So that is it for today. There was one male missing, uh, Lime Boy. He actually just got picked up, so he's not in the video. He was the choice uh, to pick right after us. So he won't be shown today, but he was a cutie too. Okay, all right, well, thank you so much and look forward to hearing everybody's draft and see where the picks end up at. Thank you, bye-bye.